But I know better days are coming. And Joe Biden and Mark down the whole line promised them. But I know say, things will look better. Understand, apart from the mix up and the, the scandal. I just miss Donald Trump and I know say, no far no. No far no, I'm not talking things. But I know them, Donald Trump says some something and he cheer we up and we laugh, you know, so what? One crumb bug in a white house. I'm going to tell you, say, that woman should have get a Oscar, man. <laughs> Boy, a alpha. All for black, white, Syrian, Japanese, Chinese, Indian, rich or poor. It's for everyone. This is Kaboom! But remember, you know, great minds discuss ideas, you know, average minds discuss events, and small minds discuss people. <laughs> this man in it come, you know it come, I don't know if we're in a fall in your area, but I hope you don't live on the sun. You understand? Because you live on sun, you know, so you're in a serious problem. And the people, them who build them house in the riverbed, we dry up for years. And through them, just in the water there. Them build them house in the water, in the riverbed. We are tell the people, them say, it's kind of problematic for you to build house on the riverside, you know, you know. Yes, because you saw the climate change up. More rain now, no rain all next year. You know. After that rain are done, you know. A drought, you know. But yesterday the abundance of water, the fool get thirsty. So with all of them water you are fall, you know, don't feel no way. Next year, next year, you go and hear people at ball say them not have no water. How oh, ironical that is. How oh, ironical it is. Well, it's like how I have enough time to do what I want, though. <laughs> it's like how I have enough time to do what I start doing it from now. Yeah, we want to play the first thing here. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, okay, here, here goes, here goes. Right, you're welcome back to the show. This is New Shroom. There's breaking news and is that former president Jerry John Rawlings just passed at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital in Accra. Uh, very sad news, Joshua. Very, very sad news. But this is news that is just coming in. That former president Jerry John Rawlings is dead at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital. Uh, he has been at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital since Sunday. Uh, we are told, and he just passed away. <sighs> but it's a devastating news that coming in at this point in time. Yeah, 25 um, days. We to understand the he, he was admitted at the cardiothoracic center at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital there, and this is quite uh, horrifying. I mean, considering just recent weeks, his mother was finally put to rest there, and such a news coming in at this point in time would actually be a devastating one for the members of the opposition national democratic congress and of course the and members Ghana of the as national a whole, i mean i mean this man um i i everybody loved him everybody loved him so it's not just a loss to the ndc but to everyone in this country it's a huge loss and may his soul rest in peace our condolences going out to the family to his wife, to the NDC, and to yeah, all the right, all right, all right. entire Sound Guinean population. Too. Very, very sad news. Very well, sad yeah, news yeah, coming yeah, through. Yeah, yeah. We understand the former president, like I said earlier, has been uh, on admission since Sunday at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital. And news just came in that he passed at the, just like Joshua said, yeah, the thoracic, thoracic, thoracic center, center. Yeah, my, at this my, moment. My. Uh, we commiserate with the family and, of course, the yeah, members of the opposition NDC and the NDP there. There and it's 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 actually a huge blow for for that the institutional processes are transparent and beyond blemish. Freedom and justice is not abstract. It is very much related to the sanctity of the right of choice. Those right, 
So um, that was the former president, Jerry John Rowling. Yes. Okay. This is very important. For those of you who know African um, things that is happening in Africa, Jerry Rollins was, a, 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 I think, he's a lieutenant who farm a coup and get out the prior, the prior president at the time. And really seriously, because most of you hear about a coup, people definitely don't like the person who, who carried out the coup. But Jerry Rollins was well loved. Well loved in Ghana. As a matter of fact, him come at Jamaica. We meet him at Jamaica already at Tosfield. But he was well loved. So we really, you know, share the sentiments of, you know, the passing of, of, of Jerry Rollins. His name Jerry John Rollins. And him, him was 73. It's today I'm dead. Today. So you get the news at half the press, right? Oh, <laughs> at half the press. May I tell you? So, another man gone where I've done a lot for really unified Ghana and even Africa in, in still. Is, it's just that him never dead now from foul means. You know, him never dead because some CIA, FBI coming out of the country come do that. You know, so we give thanks for the work of Jerry Rollins over the years. We give thanks that we did have the opportunity to meet Jerry Rollins. Yes, we really feel good for know that we actually meet him. Uh, the Virgin don't want you to push him because he's on the edge already. So don't push him. When fall. Yes, so you want know. The rain is a good thing, but it seems to be problematic for a whole heap of people. That I hear people almost say, no, please make the rain stop fall. No. Can you imagine that? Uh, people are ball say the rain are fall too much. Yeah. So, the government have a big, 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 big thing for answer to. But they not going to answer to it because really and truly, for years and years out, I don't know, I spent about well, five years, I think five or six years, that program had up on the radio and we spend most of the times I talk about the road them. Me really want them give me a job, you know. Yeah, about the a job for fix the road in a Jamaica, yeah. me personally, because it's just that me don't know nobody down there. I me know say do you get job nowadays is them call it nepotism. Yeah, it's who you know and who know you nepotism. But the road them, it's unacceptable. Everybody I realize now say it's unacceptable. We could have tell you for a long time, say, the thing now nah fix good, it's not proper. Them now nah use people who supposed to fix road to fix the road. You understand? No supervisor don't stand up over the man them more than so, you know. I tell you know that, you know. Me see people are throw a dig hole in a road and a throw white man in the road. Them not have nobody there. We are show them exactly what we are doing. You know, them just use the roller and roll it and lift it and gone. Every hole. I mark every hole from my yard to go down to Manor Park. Every hole did get cock up. And then now we see it wash out. And right now, it wash out to the level now where you don't know when you're going to go drop in. You say if you have a little car, I tell you the people who drive the, the car, they will low, you know. You see, if you see a puddle of water and it not moving, the water not moving, take extra care because it's a old day there. Why it not moving? Extra care. May I tell you, don't go on like say you want to drive fast and splash up people and all them way there. And don't realize, say, if a old day there, the water not going to run, you're not going to see the asphalt. And right now, most of the old them right now is is is, is old, old. Me want to say it on the radio, but them gonna take out the program off of the radio. But it's that kind of old there, you know, because me not understand it, Rasta. Me not understand it. 
It's not a new hole are developing, you know. it's hole where they already where I get bigger. The more the rain fall, the more them fix the hole. Because what happened now, them dig round, them make a kind of square round a hole. And left it the little. And then them come and bring white man and throw in it. And then them use the guitar and press it down and them like, That not going to work. That not going to work, you know. When we're going to start make concrete road, serious thing. When, when they're going to start turn to concrete road. Because really and truly, that is really the way to go right now. Use concrete, cement to make the road. Because them thing where them are do it, 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 it is unacceptable. Me don't know if 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 the, the minister them drive. I wonder if a helicopter them use all the way because them could not drive on them road there and not say feel terrible about it. Them no well it it, it mind boggling Rasta. It mind boggling. It mind boggling for Sikinston right now. Nobody escape this whole thing. Nearly every road when we drive pan, the old them be dead all the while, you know. But them keep covering the old them, rain come wash it out. Covering the old them, rain come wash it out. And the old them is getting bigger and bigger. So what you find now? This is last of time. Very important to people who have business. Last of time. Why last of time? Because when a portion of a car driving pan a road, and a hole in the middle of the road. The car of his slow. Eh? Alright, I'm going to go to the news and come forward. This is the Stepping Razor, the art of war. Listening to the Stepping Razor, we was actually talking about the road vibes and how we think say, you can solve a whole heap of these. This pot hole. When I ever call it pot again. Because it passed part now, and as me I say, me I wonder if these people you not know, drive on the road, government ministers, you know, Mr. Mackenzie and Holness and all them people there. I wish you them drive on. I wish you them drive on. And you, you, you see, all them attacks say, if you lick, if you lick one of them, them, them stoplight or them signal and thing, them say you could have get prosecuted and charged with it. Want well, to win them cars all for build up into some swimming pool and mash up the front end of your car. Who oh, you can't go to for that? Who oh, you can't go to for that? We keep saying it. Why is it that the contractors them who them get to fix the road? Them do have a clause in a them contract where say if Rainfall or this and it in the space of maybe six months or hour or I mean, an hour or a year and the road dig up, them supposed to fix it back at fill them cars, not at the cars of the public. You know? Why is it that the road them stay so rasta? Mr. Oldness and Mr. Mr. Mackenzie, who do not see says that shame and disgrace. Who not talk about carrying Jamaica into the 21st century and all these things. Yeah. Jamaica, I think, first world, but I live third world. Yeah, them I think first world, but really and truly, when we see them together, we know it's a third world country, you know, and maybe it's gone out of photo. Because when you look upon all the things set now, rainfall, all right? Rainfall, people say, the rainfall enough. Of course, the rainfall enough. But it's not the rainfall enough me I deal with. It's a continuous digging out of the road. Every time rainfall, whether the rainfall like how it fall now, which is unusual, or just fall. The road keep digging up and it's the same place where them just fix, dig up. How is that possible? You know things that you just fix, it now going to dig up for all years. But the rain come again and it dig up. Them me see some patch right this year. This year them fix them patch right this year. So now we have the problem of upper 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 um garden town and all. I mean what we are gonna do about all these things? What am I gonna do about it? What them really are gonna do about it? Because you can't talk about say you carry the world into sorry not the world, Jamaica into the twenty first century. 
and then the infrastructure we can allow goods and services people movement is not properly attend to that is really what i say it is not properly attend to look how long them had them had tried to do it through the junction it got a years no me stop count how much years now with how much billions of dollars eh? there are the roads split in two in a two places what is it that is happening how they might claim say they might do this and they might do that the government is working for the private sector that is what the government is doing them is working for the private sector them not working for the people the normal common people everything them do is in line with is it okay with the private sector if the money this if the money that if the stock market is if the stock market that what happened to the normal people them the the, the people them who me, me don't know me don't know because this this kind of weird how much how much how much eh Okay. Virgin. While driving through Jamaica, there's only one radio station I listen to. Iria FM. Iria FM. Iria FM. Iria FM. Bam. Oh, I don't want to tell me. <laughs> to be a top, I'm not here properly. Sorry about that. I'm not going to pan over, pal. I'm not going to pan over, pal. I wish for a time. Yeah, them, yeah, but them send me so much paper. I have to have sweet through. I have to have paper I have to work with. All right. All right. Ready for you. Ready for you. Yeah. I'm here. Eh? Good afternoon. Hello? Hello, I'm here. Hi, Muta. You hear me? I can hear you, yeah. Okay. We want to say good afternoon. Good afternoon and to you and your listeners. Yeah, the last time I spoke to you, I never think that you would be still in the position where you have to be defending the mining proposals on the radio again. But I realize that you're still in this one side environmentalist. Always an environmentalist. That is that is true. When somebody once said to me, once your eyes are open, you can't close them again. Yes, it's true. All right. So this development, I don't know if it's a new development, but obviously the public just hearing about it. I want you to take work through the whole, how it reached this stage where the government set up a, 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 a organization to deal with the environment and the standard and then when they make a ruling the government override the ruling how that work explain to me well it worked because in quite a few of our laws not just this law not just the environmental law um there is a provision in the law that the minister can overturn the decision of the technical agency so the law, which is called the Natural Resources Conservation Authority Act, or the NRC Act, which was passed in 1991, it's, it say that, you know, that they're going to decide whether to give permits for all kind of different, different, different types of developments, right? Not every single development needs an environment permit, but if they're of a sure. certain size or in a certain place, they need it, right? But the law says the minister can overturn it. Um, and all that they, the applicant, the person who wants to do it, have to do is ask for this appeal. And the minister don't have to consult the public and they don't have to invite the people that objected or they in, invite the people nearby or anything like that. And, and they don't have to give a reason. Um, they don't have to give a reason why they don't have to give a reason. No, they don't mm -hmm. have to issue it in writing. They don't right. have to call any particular expert. So is a is a problem, and it's a problem that you know the organization I have been with for a very long time has been trying to to get fixed. But you know when you start talk about oh the appeals process under the law is faulty, it's hard to get anybody to pay attention. You know, 
Yeah. So All I right. think that's how it come up when something like this happened, and that is what has happened. Um, the, the Nepal the National Environment and Planning Agency, which is like the administrative arm, they said no. They gave very strong reasons no, why they said no, and then it went on appeal to the minister, and he overturned their decision. All right. We are told through media that there was a down payment to the government of how much million dollars. I don't know if you can verify this, that the, the, gov the government got, I think it's 40 million dollars, them say, was given to the government as a kind of down payment to deal with the other the things. It's not really a down payment. It's what them call a performance bond. So it's a sum of money that stay in the bank unless there is damage, right? So suppose there is damage to the environment and yeah. the developer walk away. The government would have that money, that $40 million, to try to fix the environment. Now, $40 million sounds like a lot of Jamaican dollars and it's a lot of money to most of us. But it's not a lot of money when you talk about fixing back a whole forest system. Of course, but take hundreds of years. Of yes, it's a very yeah. small amount of money when you're talking about that. So that is what they're saying, that the developer has to put that money aside, and if there's damage, the government will take that money and fix the damage. So As it it, it sounds like a, a parallel with the cockpit country and, and, and this now. It's not like something here is, 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 a, is a similar thing. Yeah, it's a similar thing. But is in the case of coffee country, a lot more Jamaicans either live there or know about it or yeah. care about it. Um, this area, not so many people know about yeah. or live close to it. You know, although all of us, anybody that drive on the North Coast, going from Otrius to Montego Bay, is, will see it, you know, and then we'll maybe have seen it and not know what they're looking at. Yeah. You know, so that is a difference, I think. Um, less of us have heard about it, you know, and it means, don't mean as much to a lot of us. Yeah. So what is NEPA saying now? All right, they, are, they have been overridden. What, are, what is NEPA saying? Them can't say anything. They've been told to issue the permit, <laughs> the environmental permit. Um, I gather they have. Um, but there are some things that have to be put in place, like this $40 million performance bond and some other things, before they can start to mine. So, so NEPA was called for the Jamaica House to sit down with the government to really figure out what is what. Uh, this is just like a hard and fast rule. 10th, 11th no. commandment. Thou shall no. not. Yeah. And that is it. So I don't know at this point who was at the appeal, right? Because like, yeah. I, like we, we, are, we talk already, they um, them don't have to issue it in writing, right? So, yeah. so but, but you know, we have a law that says where we Jamaicans are entitled to to get information that the government holds, called the Access to Information Act. Yeah. So, Jamaica Environment Trust already did an access to information request for the notes of the appeal hearing and whatever documents came out of it. So, when that comes then I will know whether NEPA was present or who was present or who they called or, you know, what reasons were given. But the access to information request can take between 30 and 60 days. So I'm not going to find oh. out very quickly. And it might be too late at that point, yeah. you know. Yeah. All right. I want to run through what is at stake here for mining to take place in that dry dry place. What What is at stake? All right, so is a, this, is a, this is something that is hard to explain why it's so different and special. It's an it's a upraised, fossilized coral reef. So that cliff that you can see along the Queen, Queen's Highway if you're heading to Montego Bay on your left, right? It was one time under the sea. And, you know, when Jamaica, in early days, it was uplifted into that cliff that you see there today, right? And if you go up there, in fact, both of our universities in Kingston, UTEC and, and UE, it takes students up there all the time to study, to show them how, you know, the little marks of the coral reefs that are now way up in the sky, but are yeah. once under the sea. 
right? So they can teach them certain things about marine Carly environment and, and things, geology right? and reef yes. and all that thing. So it's a big educational site, right? No, it's covered with a special kind of forest called a dry limestone forest, which is not like the big trees that you see in the Blue Mountains, right? It's um, more small trees that have that have that are able to live in the, the holes in limestone. You know, limestone rock have holy per hole, holy holy, and that kind of thing. Mm. So yeah. these special kind of trees live in that kind of rock, and they have very yeah. little soil, right? Yeah. So them take a long time to grow, and if you take them out, it's very hard to get them to to grow back. And there is lots of different kind of plants and animal and those things that live there, right? That make yeah. them different. It's, it's, it's the last kind of forest like that. Um, that's in very good shape. We have some other areas that are in bad shape, but it's in very good shape on the north coast. Um, it's part of two watersheds, and you know watersheds are areas that kind of collect water yeah. from rain, and then yeah. they filter it into either rivers or underground water. In this case, they filter it into underground water. And there are and more water under the earth than in the rivers. That's what that I is correct. Saying. Yes. So, yeah. so, you know, a lot of Jamaicans do understand that most of our water supply, our fresh water supply, the water that we drink, comes yeah. from underground water, underground, from yeah. the surface rivers, you know. So this is an area that collects water when it rains. It doesn't have any surface water. If you've got there, it looks dry. Yeah. It filters the rain into the water underneath, right? Yeah. And then there's some, there's some, there's some legal aspects about it. So, you know, as we're looking around now, Mutan has seen all this damage from the rain and people flood out and, and road wash away and everything like that, right? And you hear p- politicians saying, oh, we need to be, you know, we need to have a better planning framework and we need to build, put in no-build zones and that kind of thing, right? Well, this, this development breaches two planning provisions. Of course. I mean, one of them is the St. Anne Development Order, which is the main kind of plan for every parish about what what you can put where. So it's say mm. this is a tourism area, this is a residential area, this is a quarry area, whatever, right? Mm. This is mm. a place where a road going go. And so to try and make the whole the whole development thing have a plan, right? This is in breach of that. And it's not a quarry zone, so under the mining laws, you're not supposed to go start quarry any and everywhere. Um, you know, the planners are supposed to say these are the areas you can do quarrying because it's not going to cause a lot of damage. And, yeah. you know, quarrying is very hard to live next to. If you talk to anybody that lives, you know, out by Bombay, anywhere there's big quarrying, they're, they're yeah. tougher. You know, yeah. it's bare dust and noise and, and confusion yeah. the whole time, right? So they're supposed to manage where quarries take place and put them where there's not a lot of forests or not a lot of people living or n- no chance of threaten, threatening water, right? right. And this place is not a quarry zone. Especially the water. Is the water really, I would have really look at the most significant part of it. I, well, I think so. I mean, I, you, know, you know, the climate is changing, right? Yes, and less water. Is, and that, yes, so less water. But that is also why we're having these very heavy rainfall. Yes. Frequently, right? We used to have them. I mean, more you know, most of us probably remember the flora rains back in '63 and yeah. whatever. But now they're happening much more frequently, right? And yes. they're much harder and longer. And what is very important to reduce the amount of flooding that we get from these kind of events is the forest, because the forest cannot break the force of the rain before yes. it hits the dirt. And yes. help the water to go down underground. Yes. If you take out the forest, you know, the rain just hit the bare rock or the bare dirt and it just reefs up. And the sun does come and just dry it up. And yes. So that that is so I think, given that we've lost a lot of our forests already, I think we should be looking around and saying, All right, which parts still have good forests? And you mentioned Cockpit Country, that is a place that still have good forests. Blue Mountains are another place that have good drunk forest. Moon, yes. Yeah, this is a place that have good forest. Helcha is another place that have good forest, right? You should be looking around the island and saying, these are the areas that still have good forest and we're not taking out anymore. Yes. Because we need it. We need it to try and stop all this flooding and to keep the island cooler and to, to deal with what is coming at us with this climate problem. All right. 
the other day with the cockpit thing we actually had a march and we went down to parliament building i have a gathering there yeah what is it that we can do now in relationship to this new development here what can the public do well the public should the, the, the minister that i think can change what happened is the prime minister right okay even though he was not the person to hear the appeal yeah but he means the minister of all ministers exactly so yeah. people if them have any connection to the prime minister and i don't mean know him personally you know but yes. maybe them know him assistant or maybe yes. them know yeah. you know his family member crunch? or even if them don't or, the, or, the, or, or people in the ministry but even yes. if them don't know him just write write to him and say that you don't want this to happen you're concerned about it you yes. especially don't want decisions made by the agency set up to protect our forests our water our land mm. to be overturned you don't want uh, that you know? I don't know why I feel so the government at first see the whole of Jamaica looking like New York. Well, I think With no right mountains and no trees. Yeah, well, maybe South Florida sometimes, I think that's what they're looking for. <laughs> so, you know, and you know, people think right to the newspaper if you can, call into talk shows. That's how things change, right? People yes, think yes. my little voice now make a difference, but it's not true. Yes. You know, if only one person says something, it, it's true. Of course. But if a thousand people say something, and if 10,000 people say something, it's a different business that, you know. I agree. All right, give thanks. Thank you for your thank, expertise again. Thank you, Muta. Yeah. It's good to hear your voice. It's Take good to hear you too. These times, okay? Yeah, man, give thanks. All right, bye. Yeah, that was Diana McCauley, CEO of the Jamaica Environmental Trust. And this is a relationship to this new development in St. Anne where the government is planning to do some mining in some reserved area, some area that the, the Napa, the people are responsible for the environment, who can expertly tell the government what to do and what not to do. They told the government what not to do, and the government override their proposal. Override it. So like Donald Trump, don't it? <laughs> so like a Donald Trump move. This so you hear what Diana McCalla say, Carly say a while ago about the mining again. You know, say when we are talk, when we say a while ago, it look like the government, this government, wa Jamaica look like. New York, and she said, no, Florida. Well, you know, say, I will keep a Jamaican live in Florida, and for them ambition is to have a place where it look like that, and I agree with her. You know, see, it? but you can't have a third world mind, sorry, you can't have a first world mind and I do third world things. You see, you can't do that. You have to step up your thinking, step up your mind. And right now, we see the government come like that. They, them, them still stuck in a third world. You know, them still in a third world thing. Them are run the place like them can't want get as much as them can before them lose. And them don't lose already because it's sixty eight percent of the people them never vote for them. None of them, as a matter of fact. So if you take 63% plus where the, the PNP get, a 78% of the people in Jamaica never, we can't vote, never vote for the government as of now. So the government is almost like an illegitimate government. Yes, this government is like an illegitimate government because the majority of people never vote for them. And I don't know why it looked to me like them so overwhelmed with them winnings that now them have to try to figure out the best way to get as much as them can out of this thing here before the next election, which is four years from now. Because things now go stay the same way and the thinking of the people them. The people them now go think the same way every day, every day. 
You know them say every day you carry a bucket, go away. Well, one day the bucket bottom must drop out. Well, the bucket bottom is leaking right now. And it's so drop out. Because the people them it, it, it no it I like ask the people them who 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 did I run up and down in the election the other day. The people them were since the election until now, what is it that has changed in your life? To make it more meaningful and purposeful. What is it that changed since the time you was running up and down and jump and side a bus and a blow the, the hands and all them something there? What is it in your life that is better now since you do all of that? And I even go further. Four years ago, when you was jumping up and down on the bus and going to all these rallies and making nice with your favorite party people, them and all them something there. Like, what is it that has enhanced your life since that? I talk about the common people them. Where they say common people. The people them are just depend on certain things, anti mode, anti mode. Because mostly anti mode, anti mode, you see, in the bus them. You know, me not see no appear appear black people in there, appear black people in the bus them and the taxi them and all of the the bus them when me see I drive up and down the place with the flag them and push out and all them something there. Me, me, me not say what is it for? What is it all for? Because your life supposed to be more meaningful after you work so hard and you you, you do all these things. But yet still them have the thing for the private sector is the private sector this this government is a private sector government yes they're looking out for the bankers and looking out for the the business people them that is what they might look forward for yet still we hear the people them in the private sector i make billions of dollars profit who is it that is allowing them to make these profits what is it that them is selling to rich people that is making them make the property. It's not to rich people, them focus the thing pan. It's to the normal Jamaican people. You know, see, normal Jamaican people. The government is not playing the part of a government that is for the people. That is why the Prime Minister could have looked upon the, the, the insignia upon the Governor General and I say, well, maybe he never knows that it was there. That was what was on it. The Prime Minister said that. You know? Maybe the Governor General never knew it was there. What is saying? What, what is that saying? For the so-called leaders of the country. When you, when you have had a run during the election, say, look on Three Mile. Uh, look on Kansas Spring Road and all them something there. S trying to t make the people them see things in front of them yet still the road will lead to freedom yard the road will lead to freedom drive the world will lead to freedom avenue the road where the people them have to take them food and carry go out a road for go and market with look on them road there the road will lead to <laughs> lead from Stone hill go down to calzan spring road Look by the road, but just them widen the road at the at the, at the, 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 the right at the, the corner, the, the long lane and the old Stone Hill Road. Them just widen it, and now it's unbelievable that the man them go there and dig up the road for do something. And now, anytime you drive up the road, you have to stop, you have to slow down because. You want to go over the other side of the road and a car will come down by you. What kind of madness is going on? Them just fix the road, you know. Them just fix it. And now it's a one lane traffic again I come down the road. Because you pass the stoplight and start to go up on the straight along lane now. There's this hole over the left side of the road. There's a hole over the right side of the road. And the two of them converge into one hole. One hole. Big, big hole. Can't call it pot hole. I say a swimming pool, but nobody now go swimming at that. 
What is happening? Right in front of Manor Park. Them dig up the road. In front of Manor Park, let's go. Where the bus them stop. So when when Kiara go down now, shoot them now and go in at the little the, the, the Ilangoli thing. Everybody gone over the side where the bus them supposed to, you know, it lead to a little back up. Back up. I tell you, we have a first world mind living a third world life. You know, see, we don't want to be doing that continuously because we, we have things for our television now. We show, show, well, Jamaican people have things for them television now. We show you how the other side of the world I live. And everybody's yearning for that kind of life. Especially the youth, them, the millennials, and I can't to them. When them look on them, them television, where, where, net, where, 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 where the, 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 the net, the internet open up to them, it's a place of greater than them imagination. And that is where they are, them thinking and them mind there. And if them say them can't create it here, so they go try and find some way to go over this. So. And maybe them is the ones who the Jamaican need, Jamaican need to develop the place. But if there's no opportunity here for them, what must they do? When people are saying, why right now, why look how them just get the medication and so on a Jamaica educate them and they run Ghana foreign. Go work for white people and them something. I want to tell you say, me used to say white people that want to live and go foreign go work, but me now say it again because I realize say, if you're desperate enough and you can't get no work so you want to go to foreign. I may not want to go to America to work, live in our play. I don't want to go to America. I, for the, how much years now I've been going to America? And for, for the past, how much years I've been in transiting? And then I, the man who I come to Africa, the other man tell me, say, I carry me through America. I say, look, I don't carry me through America. If you want to carry me through Panama, come round and go in a Russia and come down through Belgium and all the places. I pray for that. I don't know what's going to happen all next year now. You know, see? But it's a terrible thing. It's a terrible thing. Baby Trump, baby Trump there, him, 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 him father lose, him father lose the election and him no one give up. And him also, him all, him all start behave like one of them dictator where you don't like. You know see? We never have that problem there. But when you look on how the country around, because if them can override something where them I don't want to say employ them employ a group of people in place to tell them exactly what to do and what not to do as it relates to mining and you know troubling certain areas and them just say yeah but we are override that you know see we have veto that we don't care what nobody wants to say we not tell them why we do it we not tell them for what reason or not? Uh, we're going to just do it because watch, uh, the money more important. The money more important. Like just every one of them come and do the same thing, you know. I see me don't have you know. They might build these high rise that the people them started. They might show them, so watch out. Uh, where are we going to stop build that? I'll stop build that. The money more important. The tourist money more important. Right now, they might try to build back the tourist industry. I don't realize about what you know. Them need them just talk about farming, 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 and what guess what? The real push was supposed to go in at the farming thing, you know. Them still don't even know which part to start. Because right now, water they are like wow. And a little more from this, no water now go there. No water now go there. Me not prophesy not. Me I tell you that I saw it go. We live in a different time now. With two hurricanes, hurricane are like one place at the same time. Me never know so me could have seen that. In Louisiana, two hurricanes go right into the country, in, in, in the state, and lick it and move, move on. And now we see the amount of hurricanes where they didn't expect to come, all of them hurricanes are gone, and they have to start over the name in them now. Next year, we're not going to have no rain for a long period of time. What are they going to do? Because here we are saying, oh, so them do have no money if you do certain things. 
them do have no money. And now them are telling you them have, them have to move how much billion dollars from here, so uh, and put it over there, so to facilitate the, the people, them, the, the parliament here and them in them area where them say yes or no, them are going to put money there, so watch a man. All them things that just face makeup, I like makeup. I like makeup. It's like a coffin man. Coffin with bully of flowers and gold thing on it. And inside of the coffin is a dead body. I saw the government around the thing. Face, face wise, when you look like the three mile skyscraper where them build, like the whole heap of building them where I go up. And people say, see there, we're getting somewhere. See, whole heap of buildings, the construction businesses in this. And you know the road them is being widened and fixed and everything there. Slam bam will come back to the beginning. The road them never fixed good. Construction can't because COVID leaked certain people and them way there. So it slowed down the COVID thing. What is it that the government plan to do in light of certain things that is going to take place? Because the environment seems to be changing from one level to the next level. What happened to the education of the people? Them have how to protect where them is. Fiction because them is squatter. Why is it that them still calling the people them squatter? And is them friend thief the people them land? The Jamaican people. Them friend thief the land them. And who in the government can, can get certain land? As we saw the other day. Them get certain land for the certain things on it. And the people, them, you think the people want to live on Gully side? You think the people really want to live there? But most of them have no land. Me not have no land where my grandmother or my father did live, give me. Me not have no land like that. You know, see, most of them who have come from certain type of people in a Jamaica, them did have the land and them can pass down the land to them grand picnic. And them grand picnic, grand picnic, them can't pass it down. The normal Jamaican in a Jamaica, the only land them have is landless. You know, see? So really and truly, what we have now is a group of people who are searching for places to live. Just to live. Them want to live. And by any means necessary, them have to move to a certain place. The people, them is not educated enough to say, look here. Don't go there so go live because even though it might look good now, but down the line it's not going to be good for you nor your family. Them have the people them planting a serious thing. Them have the youth. <laughs> well, I may tell you. May I tell you. Imagine you have inside land and you have flat land. The people them should be planting and the Flat land, sorry, the inside, the inside land, I make, no, we don't understand this. The piece them should be planted on the flat land. See me, I like get confused, I know. I get confused. <laughs> Houses should be built on the inside. And planting should be going on the flat land. It, it go around in, a, in a Jamaica. People are planting on the inside. And have, and have build houses on the flat land. Oh, 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 no, no, she say, look here, you go to California to write it, and you see, it look like them take ruler and, and, and level them, level them place there. When you look at your drive, ask any musician, you drive for miles, hundreds of miles, and you, you can't see the next part of the land over the other side, look like you're going to reach a horizon. Not one house, except the house where they look after the, 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 the farm. The people them have them house in another area, in other places. In a Jamaica, government land there, there. And the people them can't go up on the land because you go up on the land, you say you capture land and you squatter. They must take out the, the word the out of the vocabulary of Jamaica. That word must be taken out of the vocabulary about Jamaican people who do have no land and go find something for them. squat them as squat. Squat is like a woman who can't find a bathroom. And she in her minivan and she say, Well, I the driver, me want to use myself. And she come out of the van and go squat. 
That is the only time she will be called a squatter. But you can't call one third of the Jamaican population squatter. Because that them tell you say, them say one third of Jamaica do is, 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 is squatting on land. Why you call the people them squatters still? In at this time yeah, after your friend them in slavery. And now we we'll never left her with nothing. And we are go to go find something for itself. And because we don't have the education and the ability to understand geology. <laughs> we don't understand geology. We just find a place and say, well, we're going to build a house right here. So, you know. What we want to tell the people, them, we must find a way how to educate ourselves about the environment. Because them not going to tell you certain things. The environment is very important. All these dumping of garbage. You cannot imagine how much garbage in the sea now. All them rain will fall. We we'll wash out all of them things that we're gonna see. You can't just imagine the whole heap of mercury, the whole heap of sanitary napkins, the whole heap of this and that when I see where the fish them I eat. And then now you're going to go down Sunday morning and go buy, buy the fish for go make Sunday dinner. When you eat about the same thing when you dash away. It's crazy. It's crazy. By the way, anybody know what it happened to this case with the whole heap of in them that them find in the, the yard man van a couple years ago? Yeah, whenever I hear nothing more about it again, anybody can tell me. What really did happen with that whole heap of cocaine in the yard man van? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. When we all get some of the politicians that go to prison. When we all get them to go to prison? Yeah, but the two sides. When, when we decide so we all send them to go to prison? Because right now, them, we, we are hugged up. They hug them up too much. Yeah. We, they, them set a system that them can't go. You understand? I'll rob the revenue and them can't go. Well, you know, the man who set the law and him broke the law is, you know, because I know the ins and outs of the law. None of these, none of these PMP and JLP now got prison. Them set it. Them rob all of the money and none of them now, you know. Them set the yeah. system. Them defend them one of that. People well. need to wake up now because here you have to have some rights. The people need to wake up now. These men need to go to prison. Of course. You know I agree with you 100%. Any side, no business side. You understand? And if you got prison now, man, get them out. Corruption. Yes. Bless up here, sir. Yeah, man. Not now, go on for you, neither, eh? Yes, here. Yeah. Muta. Yes, ma'am. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. You can't call me, you can't tell me the word unlimited means. You must tell me what? Tell me unlimited means. Means, eh, uh, well, limit means say uh, stop somewhere, unlimited means say uh, now nah, go stop. If but I can't put it mean, more milder. Ah, uh, that means we need Means, say, uh, for instance, if you have credit, and them say you have to pay $1,000, and you get unlimited credit. It means uh, it never nah, stop. Unless, unless you have a month thing to deal with. Because you have two things, not them phone thing there, you know. You have data and you have month. Anyone read first, you have to pay again. That is what I'm saying. So, eh? unlimited 30 days plan. Mm. It's $6,125, and it only lasts me for seven days. It don't last for seven days? Yes, seven days. You have only a use the data? Eh? You have only a picnic and use the data? Online school, I use the data and the plan unlimited. So, as I said, it's supposed to last for 30 days, not so. Yeah, but them say, I'm going to tell you the trick with it now. Yeah, them have a trick, you know. Because it reach me think. too. All right. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, you pay, on, you pay, how much you say you pay? $6,000? Yeah, six thousand. All right, you pay six thousand dollar for a certain amount of data in a the month. Yeah, you no, we no, we no. So anyone where you reach first, you have to go pay again. That means that uh, if you use if you use all the data 
in a one day, you have to go pay again. And if you use the data and it reach a month, you still you have to go pay for the month. Yeah, yeah, understand that it's but the unlimited is a problem. The unlimited is a problem. Unlimited when you say unlimited. Unlimited. Hmm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. In a 30 days, you use, you have unlimited data in a 30 days. Yeah, but how comes it done in a 7 days? Yeah, because you use days. up the whole of the data. You have unlimited data for use in 30 days. So if you use it in a seven day, it, it, the limit got it gone, it gone. Muta, the data 30 days unlimited. But I know what data we have. Unlimited <laughs> for how long? In you know the 30 days? Yeah. Yeah. Me know what yeah. data we have. When I when look, when I check the balance, just the unlimited. So, we are using data, and we expect to use up to 30 days. And it's done in a seven days. That's not here. Well, I, I think it's the unlimited catch you. They use the unlimited for catch you. So, to catch you later, that's illegal, later, motor. So, that's you to play a trick with the people. And I said, I'm a trick with you, later. Yeah, it comes like a trick if, if you really look at it that way there. When I'm saying unlimited data. Yeah, unlimited doing unlimited stuff. Then check it at 30 days now. So unlimited in 30 days. Yeah, 30 days unlimited plan. Then not that the, all right, no, we the whole on there. Stick up in. I can tell you what it has said. It has said you have unlimited data unlimited for 30 time, days. For 30 time. days. Yeah, for 30 days. Yeah, but if you have unlimited data for 30 days. <laughs> yes, I don't reach 30 there. You reach 70. You reach 70 and the unlimited data gone. <laughs> sorry for laugh. Sorry for laugh. I see what I said. Yeah, it's a big trick that motor. Yeah, it comes like a trick. If if them take us unlimited data for 30 days, it don't matter how much data you use, 70 data, it should have still go to the 30 days. Did you sell our plants at 30 days, unlimited, for 4,900, right? And it takes, you need to pay 6,000 odd, right? Mm. For 30 days. Yeah. So, you know, when 31 days come, we can't use that again for 30 days. Yeah, but if it no matter how much data you use, it's not the 30 days, you should use it till the 30 days. Yeah, I'm saying I use it for 30 days, in case of 7 days, we can't use yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Me understand what I say, me understand what I say. I don't have the data for girls, motor. I want some for buying another plan and all them something there. Yeah, so where you them, I do in all that? How that happen? Where you use them? Whatever I don't know. Yeah, you them there. You have to go buy another data thing. I have to buy another data from when I want to put on a 30 days plan. And that's seven days because I don't have no data. I have to find money. I have to buy another data. The data, no matter how much you, how much data you use, it almost carry up to the thirty days. If you carry up to the thirty days, so the unlimited. Yeah, and yeah, man, that's that. Yeah, 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 unlimited to thirty days. Yeah, yeah. Unlimited plan. Yeah. Are they unlimited? I get you out. They unlimited. No, I'm not get to get you out. They want trick me. Yeah, they want trick me. Yeah, I don't mean I say get you out. Them use Mota, that to trick you. Mota, they want to find one because they get 208 gigabytes. It's 3,000 dollars. And then, and then get only 12 gigabytes to use Google or YouTube. And mm. then 198. You obviously use to them find one because you know Mota. Yeah. You can't on YouTube with, with them prime bungles. So then get that yeah. most of the gigabyte there for themselves, you know. Then get the yeah, yeah. Then get the you know, the I get to Most of the people don't have no sports website, you know. Kind of sports now, where you are going. That's really? Tell me something. Your YouTube black like half last night? I don't know where they're from YouTube. I don't know where they're from YouTube. So where do you want them to do? Where do you want them to do? They might have to go somewhere else, where they're from your yard. 
No, me have a very dear to the kind of on his Zoom. I'm trying to see if the data is going to go on off the data. Mm-hmm. Understand the water? Look at it. They want themselves to stop kicking people down. I wish them to let me tell you they have planned data. Yeah, 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 yeah. I agree with you. I agree with you. But you don't have to know. The government, I see that's what I'm going to say. They have a first world mind and I live in a third world. You see, no. What first of all, them should not have no GCT pan pan laptop are coming at the island. That's the one thing. I don't the iPad them. Two, them should have talked to the the, the digital and floor and see what them can work out in the time of COVID. Give them that most youth up I forgot stay a yard. And most people do them work at them yard. The data should I mean them should have an agreement. You know. Out of your conscience for the people, them. Them should have an agreement. Flu and, and, and digital cell should have come into an agreement for help out the youth, them. Because right now, only for youth has been disenfranchised. Because they don't have no data, they don't have no Wi Fi. Yet, see, the government have boasts about how much people have iPad and how much this and that and that. They want to make Jamaica Wi Fi friendly. It is possible, Wi-Fi friendly. You know, with all this. You know, sir, a school time has gone now. Why don't give me 208 gigabytes? All right. Sister, hold on there. We have to take a break. The break kind of long. But if you want to hold on, you can hold on. We want to get the African names then, but we want to announce the winner of the the, 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 the digital thing we were just start about. The Prime Bundle app offer you various categories of different genres of the latest and hottest music. Which app am I? The answer is D Music. D Music. And the winner is Tori J. Phillips from Clarendon. Tori J. Phillips from Clarendon. Okay. In the next two minutes, we're going to ask, ask the next question. Okay, you know, so this is the the digital hour. This is the digital hour between four and five. So we want to come up with the African names them. The African names them first. So we're giving you the the man name them. Kala. K A L A. Kala. Kala means tall from West Africa. Tall. Kala. K A L A Kashka Kashka K A S H K A Kashka means friendly Kashka Keta Keta K E I T A Keta means worshipper worshipper Kwame K W A M E means Saturday Saturday Seko, Seko, S E K O U, Seko means fighter, fighter. So that's Kala, K A L A means tall, Kashka, K A S H K A means friendly, Keta, K E I T A means worshipper, Kwame, K W A M E means Saturday, and Seko, S E K O U, Seko means fighter. Okay, female. Adero, Adero, A D E R O means life giver. East African lad, life give life giver. Bibi, B I B I, Bibi means daughter of a king. Majiza, M I J I Z A, Majiza means unworker, unworker. And Gina. N G I N A means one who serves, one who serves. And Ayana A Y A N A means beautiful flower. So that's got you. Adero A D E R O means life giver. Bibi B I B I means daughter of a king. Majiza M I J I Z A means and worker. And Gina. N G I N A means one who serves. 
and ayana a y a n a ayana means beautiful flowers african names for today's children we they are with you we want to play a little thing about the the <laughs> they have the the what they call it super promotion but i tell you the program the program is filled man the program is filled uh, at least we can choose some things to cover what i'll tell you about uh, um mr rollins pathway we don't want to talk about the road i will talk to diane mccallie yes anyway here we go I tell you, sir, when I listen to this report where Courtney just got a while ago about the fireworks and the dog, them, it, it really amazing. I, I smile like what? They might talk about how the dog, them, they might use some music for kind of, you know, the dog, they might be frightened when the, the fireworks are going on, so they might use it for really. You know, make the, let the dog them feel like more comfortable with it. But did you you you, you know what to say? It's all of the all of them get a choice of song in night. Yeah, man, all of them, all of them get a choice. You know, the lady they were called a while ago. Why? I wish I could have tell her something for soothe her. But you see, she have to use them and them need to do what them supposed to do. And you can't hear such so she, is she responsible for her youth them. You, as you hear her attack, you know so she's responsible for that. Pupa gone somewhere else, me don't know. Responsible for them something, yeah. The government people them. If them hear cries like those, you know, I want them them hear cries like those out there where represent the voice of the people them out there and realize eh, it's hurtful. It's a very hurtful thing. Very hurtful, especially when you can't afford it. You know, you have other things to deal with. You know, they might talk about home, stay at home and all them something there. All right. Why them don't figure it out? Why them do the thing and don't figure it out? It needs to figure out. Most of the youth them do have no Wi-Fi. Most of them do have no Wi-Fi. You know, you know much, you know much laptop sell. You know what foreign family have to send on laptop for them for them little grandson and granddaughter and them where they eh? A whole heap of them sell, you know. And, and when you reach at the airport, it's another problem that, you know. Because you have to pay all of these. Sometimes I better you just buy, buy the thing out there and done. Blue you them charge out there. Because them cause some people and have no them have no heart, you know. Only if them friend if you if, if you know them and you can't tell your friends to watch and know when it come there just easy me will call my friend down there it 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 weird man you know say we have a little fun thing i want to play yeah we have a little fun thing i want to play i wonder how much people you know say um donald trump have a have a a relative that <laughs> It's a fun thing. That I chop up a relative in a Jamaica, you know. Yes. She she she's very upset. She's very upset that he win. So we want to play this to make you hear Donald Trump relative and moan over the losing of Donald Trump. Or oh, Donald Trump losing things. So make us see if we can get it properly. Huh? Okay, here we go. Good night, everyone. No, you know. This now is not a good time because when when you lose someone or you you go through certain stuff when you're gonna miss some you know you have some people <laughs> sorry I'm not going to lie. 
Enough man in the way go up with all kind of problem, man, problem. And when I look at Donald Trump tweet, when I go up and see him and then sit down for the name. <laughs> not now go up on the TV, this of my life now go up with no up. As a president, we call some little word where you know as a president, no time here Obama call some word where you wonder where I say. But if you know so one thief in a white house, you can look, you know, one day me Donald Trump call one country to us. If you know so you want to get a fabulous in the white house. When you look for my lane, your face, your favorite board. I know I just go miss them, I know say. I go just mix a little mix up. I'm gonna lick them and jump in my cloth, you back. I'm not business, but I'm not president. Oh, good guy. I feel it. Joe Biden never have to do this. Camilla never have to do this. But I know better days are coming. And Joe Biden me mark down the whole line promised them. But me no say things will look better. Understand apart from the mix up and the, the scandal. I just miss Donald Trump and we no say no for no. No for no I got talk to you things. But I know them, then I jump to some something and it cheer we up and we laugh, you know, so what? One crumb bug in a white house. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, that's a job. Uncle Donald. Oh, me feel it. That's a water for me. And give me two pressure pillow. <laughs> oh, you have a name saying and I go sit down pan. Enough time. Donald Trump will call some word where you know. When you see a president can call some word. When you see a president, it's like a get a fabulous as somebody where you uh, may I may tell you, say, that woman she should have get a Oscar, man. <laughs> She should have get a ask her for that performance, man. Serious performance, that. No maker. We never get no full-fledged hurricane, but the damage that was done come like a hurricane did pass through. Come and see hurricane pass through and never have so much damage, but for real, see the damage we're going here, so now. And the government has said them do have no money. Them do have no money. So we have to go figure it out a different way. So you might be living, you might be driving in some hole for the rest of the year. You might have to just live with it now as a new normal. <laughs> Can't tell you about talk this full full language you now. The new normal is the road with the whole heap of old them, more old than usual. Where you have to go driving and lick up your, your, your bumper, your fender, your all sort of thing. Yeah, man. First world thinking, third world living. That is where them have we now. And we could have gone and live with the third world as long as we have certain things in place, you know. We are talking about like shelter, piece of land. We could have good road, farmer, have a way to get them, to get them, them food off of the land. Forgot to deal with it. But it can't be on that now. It can't be on that. That's why we are pushed for agri-industry, you know, because we are saying, all we are talking about agriculture, if we don't deal with the agro-industry part of it, it's not going to work, you know. Because you see what happened here, so now, now they have to go get farmers all sort of money now for the losses where they lose because of the rain. 
They will not don't tell you that already from them time. They say, so if you keep planting, planting, and I talk about, all right, hotel crash. So what I'm to, what I'm going to do with the food? What I'm going to do with rainfall and flood come and wash the food? We need something for store the food. That is a normal thinking behavior. We need to develop those things. We need to develop it. Okay.